Talk to schools in Franklin County to find out. It's no shock to local school administrators that the COVID pandemic had a dramatic impact on student learning and retention. All the school improvement work we had been doing uh, as we went along suddenly was stopped by COVID. Nobody should have expected uh, this to be an anomaly. I mean, we, we shut everything down and uh, just like as you can point in history to major events like that that, that did shut things down. Superintendent of Frankfurt CUSD 168 Matt Donkin has more than 20 years in education. He's not shocked by COVID's impact on scores. His concerns getting the numbers to level off and without continued disparity. I think where we are is trying to stop the, uh, the sagging in our numbers and our performance. Uh, and we're seeing that, but also to see that as a whole group. Donkin says Frankfurt schools have implemented after school programs, lowered teacher to student ratio and have one on one time with teachers. But it looks like this year will be a post COVID jumping off point for education. We've made the conscious effort. Uh, this is going to be a baseline this year, kind of like that's where we are every time the tests change and see where we can build from here. First year principal at Christopher Elementary School, Keisha Cook agrees. I feel like this is a baseline for me for many reasons. This is my first year, um, you know, principal here. So it'll be my own personal baseline. But then also, yes, across um, the state of Illinois, it's going to be a good um, fresh start for everybody. Cook says she knew scores were tremendously affected by COVID. Christopher also has special programming in place, but will be initiating new programs this school year to try to offset the effect of COVID. Cook says she's using these scores as a catalyst for improvement. We are using those scores from last year and past practice to try and motivate us to do the best that we can next year. Reporting in Franklin County, Rachel Gartner, News 3. Christopher and Frankfurt administrators say to improve the numbers, we have to address the social and emotional effects COVID has had on students. Christopher says they'll implement a grant-driven curriculum in the spring to address that.